Well, and Darren O'Connor is here from Dublin Fire Brigade. You're very yeah. welcome, Darren. And you just okay. want to tell people to be careful with this stuff. Yeah. Um, until recently, it was a, a nice-to-have product. Now it's a need-to-have product. And moving forward, it will be. Um, it does contain a high content of alcohol or ethanol, which... It burns quite cleanly. It burns with an invisible flame almost, and people may it may be on fire. It may catch fire, and you may not know. And you want no. So we're going to show people yeah. how this works, right? I'm going to put some of this hand sanitizer into the bowl here, just a little blob yeah. of it, and I'm going to stand right so, back then and let you show us what what could happen. So if it inadvertently if it inadvertently comes in contact with a, a naked flame, such as a candle or cigarettes or a gas hob or something like that, you can see there. There's a very, very small flame off it, but it's quite, it is quite warm. Um, and for anyone that can't see the flame... OK, and we can moment. see that burning yeah. there, but some of these might burn invisibly. Yeah. Yeah, the burns are really... Uh, you can see there, it's melting the candle. OK, so high heat and it's long burning as well, Darren. Well, it evaporates quite quickly. If it's sprayed out like as a cleaner, it evaporates quite quickly, but if it's in something like that and it goes on fire, it, it does, but it burns slowly. It burns really, really hot, but it burns quite cleanly with no visible smoke or anything like that okay. off it, you know? So where you might be concerned here is if people are storing a lot of it in their homes or commercial premises. Commercial, industrial premises and definitely the home. If people are going to be going into bulk buying this, um, we'd advise people to store it outside your home, keep the minimum amount that you need inside the home, refill small bottles, make sure they're tightly secured and there's no vapours coming out of them. Mm -hmm. um, again, if you use it on your hands, make sure that your hands are completely dry before you use any naked flames, such as a lighter, light a cigarette, go to light a gas hob or something like that. It does evaporate off your hands quite quickly, but your hands need to be okay. bone dry when you do it.